And now let's prepare the lead screws. So for the lead screws, you have three lead screws here. And three empty backlash nuts. Okay, so the first thing you want to check is just to make sure that, that the plastic of, and the brass are securely fastened. And just kind of wiggle it around a little bit. If you notice that it's a little loose, you can take a screwdriver and there's uh, some black screws in there and just tighten them down. Okay, so to start out, you're going to take the small Fallon and you're going to screw it on just until you start to see a little bit of threads come out the end. Not too much. You can insert the spring, and when you put the large fallon on, you want to line up the, the flat surfaces on the small fallon and the brass bushing there. And you just want to push it in until you get it about a quarter of an inch in there, and then turn. And what will happen is, if, if you see that the small fallon starts to back its way out, it hasn't started yet, you have to pull this off, pull that back to where it was, and try again. And it may take you a few tries, but you'll get it. So I got it that time, uh, but the small fallon is still sticking out. We want that to actually be inset in just a little bit, maybe about an eighth inch. So we're going to try it again. So that's a little better. So as you can see, it's just pressed in there just ever so slightly. And it should go on nice and smooth. So we want to do that for all three of them. Small Fallon spring. Line them up. Push it in. Just get it started just like that. Okay, so now that we have the lead screws done, go ahead and set those aside for now. So I'm going to go ahead and take the vise out of the way. Okay, 